Today, I'm gonna to be converting this Walmart scooter into electric, and I'm gonna show you guys how quickly and easily it can be done. I'll be doing it in real time. So today we're gonna to be using a 26 inch front Magic Pi 1000 watt motor. It peaks at about 1500 watts. Um, before these things used to come with controllers like this. Uh, we don't need that anymore. This is trash. Now we have inbuilt controllers right here. You'll see these are the cooling fins. Um, and it comes with a goodie box that has brakes, uh, cruise control, throttle, and a couple other miscellaneous parts. Uh, and then I'll probably be using torque arms and a bottle mount and a battery, of course. And I'll put a link of all these parts in the description below. Let's get it. All right, let's begin. Oh yeah, almost done. I'm just gonna fill up the air and clean it up a little bit.
So here it is. I'm not sure how long that took, but I don't think it was more than 20 to 30 minutes uh, at the max. Uh, I could do a cleaner job just cleaning up the wire, but I'll probably do that later. But it's a fully functional scooter now. Um, let's take it out for a ride. All right, guys, so it's, it's so much fun to ride this thing. Look at it. It's relatively really clean for building it in like 20 minutes. Uh, you can see the wire harness and all that stuff, but yeah, for 20 minutes, it's, it's super clean. Yeah, and, and the reason for that is the internal built-in controllers, which is on this side right here. So the controller's in there. So that's the main reason for it to be a super simple, easy and fast build. Um, yeah. So if you guys have any questions, reach out, comment below and join our different clubs that we have. We have the Golden Motor Club and we have the Buffan Club. Um, join those for support and sharing your pictures. And uh, sometimes we have like exclusive bonuses, exclusive deals for uh, those groups. So go ahead, uh, join those and I'll see you guys next time. I'm off to riding more. <laughs>